If you need to know how to lace a shoe with eight holes, then keep watching because I'm gonna make it easy for you. What's up, man? I'm Andres Perez, and this is Bioman TV, where we go from boring to captivating. So I'm gonna show you how to do the sawtooth lacing system, which has diagonal and horizontal lines. When done correctly, both shoes will be opposite or mirror image of one another. All right, so the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna take our shoelace and we're gonna put it through the bottom holes um, from outside in or top to bottom. And just pull them all the way through so that the laces are the same length. Now for simplicity, let's number our shoelaces. So left is gonna be number one and right's gonna be number two. We're gonna start with lace number two, going from that first hole at the bottom all the way to the third hole going diagonally then what we're gonna do is we're gonna take lace number one and we're actually gonna go from that first hole to the second hole on the same side now this is gonna be from inside out and then just go ahead and pull that through now with that same lace we're gonna go across going outside in and just pull this through as if we we're doing a straight bar lacing um, now these laces are flat so you just run it through your fingers this will keep it from twisting all right let's continue with lace number one so we're gonna go from hole number two all the way to hole number four going diagonally from right to left if it twists just go ahead and untwist it no big deal now let's continue with lace number one we're gonna go across from left to right, from third hole to third hole. Just go ahead and pull that through. Now, let's continue going diagonally. So let's skip that hole. And if it gets stuck, we'll just go ahead and pull it through. And then we're gonna continue um, from left to right. So if you notice, the tongue does have that loop on it. And you can just go without going through it. Personally, I like to. It just helps keep it up. Um, so that's what I do. We're going to continue with lace number two. We're going to go through that loop. And then we're going to continue onwards. To that fifth hole. Sorry, sixth hole. Alright, now let's continue with lace number one. We're going to go across. Now you could go through that loop again, but um, what I like to do is I, I like to actually go over it. That way we continue this, this look that we've already created. Now at this point, I figure you already know what to do. So just continue that pattern that we've done. I'm going to speed this up a bit and um, just keep going uh, till you get across from the seventh hole. And then I'll explain what to do in just a little bit. All right. Okay. So what we're going to do is uh, basically you're just going to go up from that seventh hole all the way to the eighth hole. Going through the bottom. If you want more shoelacing ideas, then make sure to check out the playlist below. If you want to be more captivating, then make sure to subscribe and turn on the bell notification so you can be notified of any time I have new ideas for you.